while we're able to save our search strategy, it's very likely we may also want to export our results. Now that may mean we want to export everything, or it may be that we want to pick out individual papers. If we want to export everything, we'll click on the share option and then select the email a link to download exported results option. Here you're given five file types that you can export to. I would recommend RIS for anyone using a reference manager, whether it's EndNote, Mendeley or something else. You then just put in your email address, click send and you should receive an email with a download link and that will allow you to download the RIS file in this case and use it in your preferred reference manager. On the other hand, if you only want to save certain results, not the entire list, you have a couple of options. You may want to export records individually. To do this, scroll down to your results and click on the little blue folder icon to the right hand side for any paper that you want to export. This will then add the paper to your folder. If you want to export an entire page, I highly recommend flipping to a larger number of results per page via the page options menu and then under the share menu you'll find an option to move an entire page worth of references to your folder. If you're wanting to export to Excel this is the method to use. Once you've put all papers that you wish to export into your folder you can then go to the folder itself and run the export. Here I've put my records into the main folder and I can then export either the whole lot by simply going to the export option on the right hand side of the page or by selecting individual references that I want to export and then clicking the export option. You're now going to generate a direct download and you'll see that you have additional file types that you're able to export to. If you want a file to Excel, for example, you can use the download CSV option. And all you'll do then is click on the save option and that will export your results directly into a file which you can then use.